Uh, which school did you attend? Public or private? Private. Mm -hmm. What was your favorite subject? Maths. Why? It was easy. It was easy. Yes. You still think up to today it's easy? Yes. Oh, that's good. Well, did you participate in extracurricular activities? Hmm? Extracurricular activities like football, like painting, like music. Did you? Football. Yes. Okay. Were you? Did you go to competitions? You no. didn't, but uh, you still like it up to date. Yes. Okay. Uh, how did you prepare for exams? By revising. Revising. How did you revise? That uh, tell us. I would go home. Mm -hmm. Revise at night. At night. Yes. Okay. No, in the morning. And in the morning. Yes. So you was you used to wake up at what time? Four. Four. So when you wake up at four, what do you do? You prepare yourself, take a book and then you read. Oh, you take a book and then you read. Were you reading textbook, your exercise book? Were you reading revision papers? What were you doing? Exercise books and the revision books. The revision books? Yes. So which one which ones do you think were more helpful to you? The revision books. Oh, the revision books. Yes. Okay. What career path are you considering? Civil engineering. Why? What does a civil engineer do? Yeah. We should research on that. That's why I'm asking. You should research about a civil engineer, yes? Yes. So that you see whether you like, like when you go home, you Google about it. Yes? what he does so that you can learn early enough you'll still be civil engineer but you'll be knowing more right so that when you <clears throat> when you're outside from school you can be able to to get more grasp of what you want yes okay do you know any civil engineer okay you will know now when you google you see even in your phone it will be coming even if you use your parents you see it will be coming over and over so you learn. Even if you don't want to read it for a long time, you can you can go to TikTok and uh, civil engineering, and then you will see you will see very short videos, yes, and they'll be interesting. So that now you can start learning earlier about your career. Did you receive career guidance in in school? No. Okay. Were you involved in any community service? No. Uh huh. Did you have access to technology in school? Like what? What? Uh, computers. Computers. Yes. What did you use the computers for? They were used for learning. For? Learning. Oh, for learning. Yes. You, you, you are also you are able to get your own to use your own computer. Yes. Okay. You used it to like read what? Yeah, we do research on the on the questions that have been given. Mm -hmm. For papers. Okay. Did you face any bully, bullying incidences? You didn't. Now, what challenges did you have in your education? What did you feel is challenging? Was it difficult for you? Subjects or uh, general anything. Some of the teachers were not teaching well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's one thing. Mm -hmm. And how did you deal with it? You know how you are supposed to say you dealt with it. Like for example, if you continue those subjects, you you keep on revising them harder because now you see no one is going to help you. The, did you attend any tuition classes? Yes. Mm -hmm. In the school or outside school? In school. How much are you paying for it for them? Per day we are paying eight shillings. Eight shillings. Yes. Um. When did you go for them? At what time? When you are when people are close. The tuition of pay for when people are close for like one month, mm -hmm. you go for tuition for two weeks, mm -hmm. then the others are you rest. The others you rest. Yeah. So, when you went for tuition classes, what were you doing? We are learning the normal way. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, and uh, did you have an access to the library? Did you have a library? When did you go to the library? For a 
Mm-hmm. And he died. Yeah. He gives. So you are allowed full time. Huh? So you are allowed to go there during break time all the time. Yeah. Okay, that is good. Um, were you involved in any student leadership? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What were you? I was captain. You were the captain. Yeah. How was it? Yeah. It was good. What challenges did you get? You didn't have any challenge. Mhm. Mm okay. Uh, Thank you. Yes, that's good. You know, we tell you. Yeah. The relationship that you are. Mhm. Mm between boys and girls is not good. Mhm. Mm you should focus on your education. Mhm. Mm if they compete. Mhm. Mm Okay. Where did you have to did you have your lunch at school? Yes. Mm -hmm. What did you have for lunch? Like tell me different meals that you had. Rice. Mm -hmm. Cabbage. Mm -hmm. Meat. Meat, uh -huh. Chapati. Chapati. You were really in a good school. Mm -hmm. Those ones. Those ones. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, did you have any challenges with your fellow students? No, how uh, how how come you didn't have? How did you deal? Mm. Because was umboy. Na kama mtu ame uswa chokozi na kama mtu ame kaserisha. Just forgive and forget. That's your 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 nini your motto. Yes. Which is good. It's so good. Thank you. I just